To create the fault, we will download OB1. Turn monitoring on. The PLC has gone to the stop mode. Go to the PLC menu and choose module information. Alternatively, you can press and hold the control key plus the D key. Click on the Diagnostic Buffer tab. Message 1 tells you the CPU has gone to stop. Message 2 tells you a data block is not loaded. Click on Message 2. In the Details section, you can see that the data block not loaded is DB17. What's happened is that when the programming call was made to function block 17 and DB17 was created by the programming editor, we forgot to download DB17. This is an easy mistake to make. When OB1 was downloaded, function block 17 was called for followed by a call to data block 17. When data block 17 was not found, organization block 121 was called for. When it was not found, the CPU went to stop. Minimize the programming editor. From the project's block folder, locate DB17 and download it. At the CPU, toggle the switch to stop and back to run. You can also place the CPU and run through the PLC menu, Diagnostic Setting, and Operating Mode. The fault is fixed and the block can now be monitored. To learn more about troubleshooting when OB121 is loaded in the CPU, watch the video OB121. This concludes the video Troubleshooting a Data Block Not Loaded Fault.